Hello everybody, it's Abdir Isaac and today I'm thrilled to have the opportunity to share with you the remarkable life and contributions of an influential figure who has left an indelible mark across various aspects of life. Ladies and gentlemen, get ready to be immersed in a captivating exploration of a visionary whose influence transcends the boundaries of leadership alone. Today, we celebrate the life and remarkable contributions of a man whose impact spans the realms of management, industry, knowledge, and leadership. Be prepared to be inspired by the multifaceted genius of John Adair, a true titan of our time. John Eric Adair is a British academic who is a leadership theorist and author of more than 40 books translated into 18 languages on business, military, and other leadership. John Adair had, had contributed in so many areas such as leadership and management. John Adair, best known for his three-circle model of action-centered leadership, is widely regarded as the UK's foremost authority on leadership and leadership development in organizations. He has written over 40 books and more than a million managers have taken his action, action-centered action leadership programs. Adair, along with the late Warren Penis, firmly believes that leadership can be taught that it does not depend on person's traits and it is a transferable skill. Adair's ideas remain bubbler because they are practically unrelevant to managers irrespective of, of working environment and his work is instrumental in overturning the great man theories of leadership. Adair is a prominent of drawing a clear distinction between leadership and management. The latter, he contends, is rooted in a mechanic, his control and systems. He contrasts this, this with the teaching method, action-centered leadership that has proved to be an enduring approach defining leadership in terms of three of loving and independent circles, task, team, and individual. John Adair is, le is less well known for his other ideas on the practical aspects of leadership such as decision-making and personal effectiveness, although Many of these ideas were ahead of their time and now widely taught and applied. So, when it comes to action-centered leadership, basically this simple and practical model is figuratively based on three of eleven circles. This represents the task, the team and the individual. The model seems to endure well, probably because it's the fundamental model for describing what leaders have to do actions they must take whatever their work environment in order to be effective the first one is achieve the task and the second one is build and maintain the theme and the third one is develop the individual so task team and individual and this concept asserts is that the three needs of task team and individual and the watchwords of leadership as people expect their leaders to help them achieve the common task build the synergy of teamwork and respond to individuals' needs. So, in terms of leadership and development, Adairis has been instrumental in the development and promotion of leadership development programs. He has designed and facilitated various training courses, workshops, and seminars focused on enhancing leadership skills and capabilities. In practical leadership models, Adair has created practical leadership models that have provided a structured approach to understanding and practicing leadership. When it comes to authorship, Adair has authored over 40 books on leadership and management, making him a prolific writer in the field. His books have been widely read and translated into multiple languages, influencing leaders and aspiring leaders worldwide. In academic contributions, Adair has held academic positions in renowned institutions and universities, including the University of Surrey, where he founded the Center for Strategic Leadership. He has conducted research and contributed to the academic literature on leadership and management. In industry and economy, leadership development programs, Adair's expertise in leadership development has been widely sought after by organizations across different industries. He has designed and delivered customized leadership programs that have enhanced the leadership capabilities of executives, managers, and employees, leading to improved organizational performance. John Adair's contributions have made lasting impact on leadership theory, development, and practice. Developing a personal sense of time. 
Adair's view of time management accords closely with Peter Drucker's, in that he argues for the prior need to manage a time in order to, to manage anything else. Adair was one of the first management thinkers to emphasize the critical importance of time management and its central role in focusing action and helping leaders to achieve goals. For Adair, time management is not simply about being organized or efficient or completing certain tasks, it's about managing time with a focus on achievement. Time management should be goal-driven and results-oriented. Success in time management should be measured by the quantity of productive work achieved and the quality of both the work and the person's private. So, leadership and decision making. Another significant contribution of John Adair to the field of management is his exploration of leadership and decision making. Adair recognizes that leaders often face complex decisions that have a significant impact on the organization and its members. He emphasizes the importance of informed decision, encouraging leaders to consider different perspectives, gather relevant information, and weigh their potential outcomes before making choices. John Adair provides frameworks and approaches to enhance leaders' decision-making abilities, including the exploration of risks and rewards, stakeholder analysis, and ethical considerations. By shedding light on the complexities of leadership decision making, Adair has empowered leaders to make more effective and well informed decisions that positively impact their teams and organizations. When it comes to personal development and reflection, John Adair promotes personal development and self reflection as a vital aspect of leadership growth. He encourages leaders to continually learn, reflect on their experiences, and seek feedback to improve their leadership and management effectiveness. In his recognition and awards, John Adair has received several awards and honors for his contributions to leadership development. He was appointed as a fellow of the Leadership Trust Foundation and was awarded the Lifetime Achievement in Leadership Award by the Institute of Leadership and Management. Ladies and gentlemen, those were the contributions of this inspirational man to management and leadership. I hope this video is insightful and you can gain knowledge about the tipping point of John Adair. Thank you for watching this video. If it meets your expectations based on the thumbnail, please consider liking and sharing it.